you've got to admit, this is one of the most interesting things a person could do. Spend a night in a glass igloo. And here's the resort's glass teepee. Here's the inside of the glass teepee. It's nice and toasty inside. Here's their ice bar. Yeah. Pretty popular place. Yeah, let's slap them all over It's always so interesting talking to both the guests and the staff. The lady with her back to us is from Estonia, and our waiter last night is from Bangkok. One of the reception people is from China. Breakfast is served and from 8 until 11, and if you come in around 10 o'clock, that's a perfect time because the reindeer people and the dog sledding people, everybody leaves around 10 a.m. to the different excursions. I'm going to have to ask somebody here exactly what kind of wood these humongous logs are. I mean, they are so big. I got the answer on the wood. It is, the owner said it's dead pine and it's only found in Lapland and along the border of Russia, which we're certainly not very far from. What I thought was potato is not. It's called Karelian pie, a favorite Finnish dish. And it's made with a rye crust filled with rice pudding or mashed potatoes and baked. And then they put boiled egg butter on top. Delicious. It's really good. And here I thought, well, I was sort of right. They can stuff them with potatoes. It's no wonder I thought it was potato. They still like potato. They also have a snow chapel if you want a destination wedding. Can you imagine being pulled by, by the Sami people in your own reindeer up to the chapel? I can't even imagine the upkeep on a place like this. And here is our little glass igloo for tonight, number 16. Ooh, it's nice and toasty in here. Oh, please let there be just a little bit of northern lights tonight. I've got to say this is one of the neatest things we've ever done. The glass igloos have a small little toilet, which is nice. No showers, but who needs one for one night? The people that are staying here for in glass igloos for their whole stay, there are communal showers and saunas for the people to use. To maximize your star viewing and hopefully northern light viewing, the beds go up, at least the, the head part does, just like in hospital beds so you don't have to crane your neck. Tonight is a very yummy vegetable soup. It's such fun. I know I keep saying this talking to people, but now the people behind us are from Sydney. And they're going to work their way up to Ivalo. And then from Ivalo up to Kirkenis and take the Hurtigruten ship back down to Bergen. Well, you could see I almost demolished my steak and potatoes, which was perfectly cooked before remembering, oh, I did not video the food tonight. This is dessert, and I think those light-colored berries are the cloud berries. Don't ask me anything more than that, though. You can see all the little different berries that are in there. Ooh, they opened the ice hole. Um, I don't think so. <laughs> Oh darn, that looks cold.